My name is Alex Kratowski, and I'm a researcher and writer about technology. I'm at the Guardian newspaper and the Observer newspaper, and also at the London School of Economics. Search engines are fascinating systems. Um, they are literally the things that make the web usable. Imagine if you wanted to go somewhere, you wanted to find something, and you had this vast resource, you had a library of information, but you didn't even know where to start because things weren't arranged alphabetically or they weren't arranged by subject or, or whatever. There was just no, there was no method to the madness. It was just information chaos. Well, search engines, what they do is they make things completely ex explicable. They allow you to find information that's relevant and valuable uh, for what it is that you're specifically seeking. So when you type a, a word or a question or a name into a search engine box, what that effectively does is it goes through all of its information and all of the things that it has in its memory, so this gigantic brain, and then picks out those things that are specifically relevant or valuable to you. Each search engine has a, has a different way of doing that. And I wonder and I question whether the way that a system like Google or a system like Yahoo or a system like MSN or even something like AltaVista, any of these other search engines do it, if they actually pick out the thing that really is the most relevant and valuable, how does it know what it is that I actually want to know. What, what is it that Google provides? What essential human need does Google serve you, is my big question. And my second question is, how well does it do that? <laughs>